Boys, in this video, we're going to be breaking down one of my favorite routes in college football 25. I think this route is going to carry over to Madden. It was one of my favorite routes and kind of concepts. And ironically, you can hot route it. Um, this can come out of any formation. This is a hot route. This is a really cool route. I think a lot of people are sleeping on doing this because this beats man coverage, zone coverage, and spaces of the field really well. It's hard to use her this route. There's a lot of benefits to running this route. And you're probably not thinking about what I'm going to be calling. We're actually going to be calling Flood. But we're going to be calling this for the in route on the left side. Now, you don't have to have this in route specifically. You just need a in route. And I'm going to show you one of my favorite route combos in the game right now with this, with this little concept. So all we're going to do is we're going to use our custom stems. So what I like to do here is basically take my tight end and put him on a slant. I'm going to put my outside bunch receiver on an in route, and I'm going to stem this in route all the way down. That's going to turn this in route into like a three-yard in route. And then we already have that in route on the right. We're actually going to stem that in route to about 20 to 25 yards. We want to get that basically in that 20 to 25 yard range. And then we're going to have a clear out streak over the top. Now that clear out streak, if you want to, we can actually make that into a super deep post, a super deep corner, whatever you want. I personally, right now, just like the streak. So you see this is what the route combo looks like. And we're going to motion this guy outside, let him kind of set his feet, and then we're going to snap the ball. So our first read is obviously going to be our tight end quick across the middle. And what that tight end is going to do is he's going to beat man coverage for us. I'm actually going to cover this one of my favorite plays against man coverage uh, in this game. But he's also going to clear out a lot of those underneath yellow zones and basically force their user to defend this backside in route. So you'll see here against man coverage, this tight end slant. Norman does a really good job of just getting good separation against that coverage. But essentially what we're able to do now is this tight end slant is going to clear out all the space for our backside uh, in route. And again, using these stems really creates kind of a essentially a high-low read. So you see here, all those yellows get cleared out. This is going to be open. So they're going to have to kind of come underneath and, and defend that. And that's a super hard route to defend because it's just going to basically come across the formation super simply. You know, another way you could run this, if you wanted to use the short cross, you could use the short cross as well. But in general, you know, I like this setup. So then what you're going to be able to do with your backside in route is this is going to go 25 yards down the field. So there's not really a lot of yellow zones that are going to get that kind of depth. But because he's running an in route and not a post route, he's not running into the deep blue zones. He's literally going to cut super sharply underneath of the deep blue zones. And so because we have this clear out streak, we're able to run all of the defenders off the top of the defense. And you'll see here, Basically, when he cuts to the inside, we have the entire string of that 25-yard depth to be able to work. So let's say, for example, your opponent you know, has a little bit better middle of the field coverage. Maybe they shade up. Maybe they get a little bit better middle of the field uh, coverage here. Then what you're going to be able to do is you just wait on this in route, and you'll see he'll just drag all the way across formation. So show that to you again. And let's um, just kind of imagine like we're going to have – Obviously, a lot of time. Again, they're going to have to, they're going to have to user this, right? That's that's kind of the big idea here. So, because they're going to have to user this all the way across the formation, we can easily just check down to our backside in route. Now, if you want to, this backside in route, it can be five, ten yards. It doesn't have to be, you know, you can throw this kind of right here. But as you see, it's going to hold that yellow, hold that yellow, hold that yellow. And then, if we had some uh, some time in the pocket, we'd be able to throw this. And like I said, you know, they can stem this all the way down, or you could be about six, seven yards. Either way is going to be fine for what we're, we're trying to accomplish. And you want this to go to 20 to 25. So you see here, you just wait on this, 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 wait on this. See how it goes super flat across the formation? Throw it all the way across the field. So now they're going to have to have a 25. Like, the, you're attacking the entire, like, string of depth, which is super good because – about 20 yards, there's not a lot of yellow zones that are going to be able to defend that. So now if you think about, like, just in general, where's the zones going to be, well, the zones are oftentimes going to be shaded underneath, right? So let's say they take this linebacker on the left and they use her the, the route after they kind of use the slant. Well, then late in the play, you're going to be able to just check down to that read right there. Super easy, super basic. Another thing you can do is you can actually do – Kind of significant different depths here, so we'll go about uh, we'll go about like a ten yard depth, 
2025. So you see how this kind of works. So now we're attacking the field on different levels. So essentially, if you think about it, these underneath yellows are going to go to the tight end. Now you have kind of this backside guy coming over the top. And you see how you can kind of layer your routes together. This is what I really wanted to show is these in routes are super good because you can layer them against zone. But the other thing that makes these out routes, I think, probably the most uh, just enjoyable route to use right now is – you can layer them against zone, but they're also good at man beating. So you'll see here this in route, this is cover two man, and look at this in route, just absolutely torch its man coverage across because it gets that sharp cut across the field, right? So you can do a lot with this play. Um, and these in I mean, I would like, you can get this, I mean, right here, this is just over 25 yards. We're gonna do a little short cross underneath of it. And then, you know, maybe we do like a little short cross here and we're gonna motion snap it or something. You see how kind of this works. But look at this, this is route. The deep blue just doesn't play it. And it's a big hitter, and they're going to have to use her that. And it's not a super easy user, if you think about it. It's really not. And then if you pepper, like, these short, the short cross, and then, I mean, even just a combo like this, this is super fun using these stemmed in routes. I think these in routes are so good because now you have kind of these attacking again. We're just attacking the field on different levels. So we have that short cross that's going to go – across the middle of the field at one depth. We have this underneath in route that's going to go across the field at a super shallow depth. And then we have kind of that third level with that deep in route on the back end that's going to really attack kind of that user. So you have the ability to literally just, I mean, even with just your in routes, like if what, check this out. So I'm going to put the tight end here. Let's put him at about a 10, if 15 yard stem. We're going to put this guy at that 30 yard stem. And then we're going to have this kind of check down that's going to be super underneath like this. Look at how this play works. I mean, this is kind of a cool little play here. And you're just able to attack so many different depths of defense. It's super hard to defend this. So I really like this, these in routes. The reason I like the in routes is because they run super fast. Um, but I really like this, the way this play works. So if you want to check this out, uh, again, if you like this content, you want to get better at the game, join our school community. It's only $10.00. Get you access to all of my offensive and defensive ebooks. Best place to get better at college football 25 and Madden. Cool part is you get everything for the $10. So the link is in the description below if you want to go sign up.